Hi, I'm Sarah from So Cool Creation and today I'd like to show you how you can make an imaginative Easter hat or bonnet with your child. Today I'd like to show you how you can make this chick with your child. Everything that you'll need to make this is sold in a kit that's available from my website www.socallcreation.com So the first thing you need to do is to take your tennis ball and a sharp pair of scissors and make a, a hole in the tennis ball and place the tennis ball on top of the two wire pieces. So the tennis ball is going to hold those together to give it a little bit more strength and it's going to act as the head of the chick. Then take your two cardboard wings, fold over the edges and tape them around the frame. And then all you need to do is with your child, glue on some feathers to make them look like wings. So let's start making the chick. You take your feather boa and tie a piece of wool or yarn onto each end of the feather boa. With the first end, tie it just underneath the tennis ball to hold it in place. There we go, cut it off with some scissors and then what we're going to do is starting with the other end we're going to thread the feather boa around the tennis ball to make the head of the chick. So we're going to go front over the top of the tennis ball, round the back and we're going to come through the frame like this. So it looks like the chick has a Mohican cut and we're going to pull it quite tightly so that it stays in place and then we're going to turn the frame and we're going to take the feather boa around the wing and thread it through the frame to the opposite side All right, pulling it through take it round the back of the wing over the top and then we're going to thread it through one more time. You might find it easier to thread through if you take the end of the boa. So pull it tightly so that it stays secured around the tennis ball and you might need to adjust it slightly so you don't have any bald areas. I think that feels all right. So that's the head of the chick. And now what we'll do is we'll take the feather boa and we'll pass it across one wing, around the back of the other wing. Yeah, keeping a, a tension on it so that it's not too loose, not too tight. Thread it around the back. Now we're starting to form the, the body and we'll take it around the front and then, and then with that end, we'll tie it onto the bottom of the metal frame. So I decided to, to put white wings on the chick just so that you can see the contrast um, but it should look something like that and then what you'll need to do is using the templates provided in the kit cut out the eyes and the beak and the red pieces and the feet and once you've cut them out, you can glue an area of the face and stick them on. I find it, it is a little bit easier to use a spray adhesive, but uh, I know it can be quite expensive, so you can use a, a glue that you can paint on instead. You can make a yellow one or a white one, but you'll find all the materials that you need in my kit um, for a, hopefully a prize winning Easter bonnet you can go to my web website www.socoolcreation.com to find more information or to get in touch if you have an idea.
for an Easter bonnet that you'd like to make and uh, offer you some help. Okay, bye-bye. Thank you.